These are going to be the arepas. Oh! oh I What's up, guys? Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the, the channel. channel. It's your boy Sam. We are back with another food review today, y'all. It's yes. been a while. Yeah, it has been a while, and like we were trying to think, like, what didn't we try yet? I mean, Honestly, like, I know there's a lot of things that we haven't tried, but that we we're like. Uh, but we have tried a lot, we though. Baby. We tried yeah, a lot. Yeah, we tried a lot of food. So today, as y'all can already see from the title, we are coming. At y'all with some Venezuelan, Venezuelan food. food. Oh, it sounds yeah, so Yeah, we good. had to like, it's a long story where we just went through for an experience. <laughs> to it find was a whole Venezuelan type food. type of mall in this shit. I don't even know what was going on. It we definitely gonna have to was. Do a, we gonna have to do like a vlog. That was nice. There, you know guys, it literally saying? looked like a Mexican mall, guys. It was just like, bro, it was so deep in there. It was, I was not expecting that. Guys. The place is called Arepa Grill. Shout out to Arepa Grill for uh, supplying us with this food. Yes. Yeah, so I'm hungry and I'm ready to jump in. And I wanted to tell you how that we did tell, I did tell them to get us like a drink that we didn't really like just to use surprises with a drink. But I think he gave us the tea and that's kind of the one that I didn't want to have. Me neither. But, but he said we're going to see it. He says it's Venezuelan, Venezuelan tea. tea so. so we're going to see how, the, how it tastes the difference. But let's stop talking. Let's, let's get, get ready to this to video. video. Let's go. This is the bag of everything that we got. Guys, I'm really out of all the food reviews, except maybe like the hungry. Jamaican or like Haitian. This one I'm very excited for y'all. Alright guys, so this was their beans. Black beans. Black beans right there. I love black beans. Same here. Alright, so you can what tell them what this? these are. What is this, guys? Nah, it, it seems like we got. Oh, I think this is the. That's a. Um, oh yeah, what was that? What was that? The Katrina? Uh, I don't know what this was. We have the names oh, all right okay. here, guys. Oh, my all right. Gosh. So this one, I think, is gonna be the Chachapa. Chachapa, Chachapa queso, queso mozzarella. mozzarella. All right. Show them that. <laughs> That's how he said it. So this is how it's gonna look. Guys, that so looks crazy. So it's um like maize, um which is kind of like a corn flour type thing where they make like tortillas and shit. But um so yeah, this has like shredded chicken in there with some type of mozzarella cheese. I'm so and excited. And I don't know what yo. else is in here. It looks like some type of spices with the chicken. Mmm. It smells smell. like it smells oh good. No, it gosh, smells really good. Gosh. So I wanted to show y'all if y'all can see that close. Hold on. Okay. Oh, oh there we go. There we go. There we go. That. So again, so guys, that was that called looks. the Chachapa no, queso not mozzarella. I don't know. Chachapa. Chachapa. Chachapa queso Chachapa? mozzarella. We gonna yeah, leave it at that. That's what it is. Guys, did y'all see the cheese coming out, busting from the side? Like these are ooh. the. You don't even know who you're looking I, at. He's saying, "Ooh, he's not even know." I think this is the arepas. Arepa tires. <laughs> no, or, it's not. It's not the empanadas. No, like you just saying stuff. This is the tequeños bocadillo. Bocadillo. Taquino Bocadillo. Taquinos Bocadillo. Anybody who is Venezuelan who lands on Let this video, know. please help us out. Comment below. Let us know. <laughs> nah, but this is the Taquinos. Um, he said this is going to be the queso y guava. So this is going to be the um, guayaba, like the paste. Um, it's like a fruit. But yeah, God. so I already know. Did you know what the guava is? Mm -hmm. The little paste stuff. The paste stuff, the jelly filled looking yeah. things. Okay. Guys, y'all see it. So we're gonna put that back in here. I'm yo, I'm so excited for this, yo. Those okay. look smack. Everything that we've just yeah. seen so far looks good. Okay, so this is it's just the, the rice. arroz. That's that. Okay, so these are going to be the arepas. Oh! oh, I oh my God. Why would you put it there? Wait a second, head. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm yes, gonna get it. Get Why it. would you put it right you there? You see me put it right there. I'm grabbing the thing and you now. Hit me in my head. Oh my gosh. Come on, guys. I'm really kind of. I'm really. Yo, I swear, every right food now. review, Carly knocks over something. I'm saying, Does why she would not? You put it right there. You didn't see me? Why would you put it right there when just I'm look, grabbing this? Just, just save, save at least half, because it oh looks like the whole thing God. fell. <sighs> that happened so quick, and you almost knocked me out. Guys, it really went all over the floor, man. 
Wow. We're all over the floor, guys. I don't even want to show you right now. I'm kind of mad, but I'm like still happy because this is some good food. But I'm still mad because it's good food and we just dropped it on the floor. Well, I don't even know why you put it right there. So I saved some of it. I like, mean, most of it was left in there, so there wasn't as much. There was. Wasn't, babe, that's a lot. No, that wasn't that much that fell out. So this is going to be the arepa, arepa type thing. Arepa katera? Arepa what is it? Yeah, a, a repa katira? No, a repa katira. Katira. Or something. I don't know. Katira. Don't, a repa don't judge yourself. It's corn and it's like pancakes. That's what they said too. Oh, it was the corn, Venezuela corn pancakes. Yes. No. Yes. That's it. I that see. was this one. No, oh, no that, I don't know. That, no, that's the chicken. No, this, this one. Yeah, that's that. You said it. A repa katira. Yeah, we don't know. <laughs> yes, that's it. I okay, know that's so it. Okay, so no, I think this one is it though. All right. Yeah, no, no, it is. Wait. It is. No, this why, one. Why is. would this be the cachapa queso mozzarella? Yes, this one is. Cause this is just the cheese. This one is the arepa catera, cause that's the one with the chicken in there. I, we I got mean, it backwards. I, I guess. I no, guess. it is. I have a okay. picture on my phone. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, y'all, it's backwards. I'm right, so, so this, sorry. This is the cachapa this queso mozzarella. This is the cachapa queso mozzarella. I mean, it does, does kind of sound right because all the cheese. All yes. Stuff. And then the other one is the one with the chicken in it. Hold on. Look at that, okay. guys. That's crazy. That man. looks good, but I don't like when my cheese is cold, so come on. The empanada. Okay. Their empanadas look definitely different from the definitely way that homemade, we do it from the Puerto just the way that, that shell looks like. Yeah. So this is our first Venezuelan empanada. Man. Yeah. Good so day, this yeah. is going to be their empanada. Alright. So yeah, this is going to be their empanada and how it looks. That looks so I feel good. like it their uh dough, however they you know it definitely is different. It looks more like I think Annalise had one of these like the other day from somewhere else. Mm -hmm. And it was Colombian and it was similar to this. I'm ready to eat it. So that was all of our food that we got. We and got then, some sauces though. We got we a lot of sauces. Sauce. Orange. Oh, this looks like the sauce for the uh, tostones. It looks like mayo, mayo ketchup. ketchup. This looks like a garlic, maybe a garlic sauce or like a cheese sauce. Green sauce. This looks like cilantro sauce or something. Okay. So I that's know. one of my favorites too. But all right. So we're gonna both get a sauce. And then again, we got the nest tea, Wait, the Venezuelan tea. That's right here. Oh yeah. And then, and we then got the, the other drink. Be we got a. Be careful. Be careful. We got uh, the passion fruit. passion fruit called a per perchita. Perchita. Peruchita. Parchita. Parchita. Again, guys, you gotta help us out with these names. Parchita. Mm, that has to has to be good. Go ahead. Like when you bit it, babe, it almost. That's crazy. Oh my god. Yum. I never had anything like this ever. I mean, obviously, but this it's like a little. It's like a little tiny, like crispy. Then like when you bite into it, it's like real juicy, juicy soft, soft, and like it's not even no pulling apart or nothing. Like it, j it tastes like you don't. It's seasoned very well. Very well. That chicken is seasoned very like, well. Like y'all, look at how crazy this looks inside. Yeah, um, that that is. Yeah, look at how oh crazy this looks gosh. inside. Like y'all see how the cheese is. It's just like melts in mm. your mouth. Like, Guys, and when you bite it, you can't even really taste the corn tortilla, tortilla, whatever the breading it's is. The mine you just the, really, yeah. the breading melts in your mouth. But like, let me get another bite, babe. Mm. This, guys, this is amazing. Mm. Amazing. I got a 10. Oh my gosh. Mm. Yeah. I give that a 10. Yeah. You? Yeah. This is uh, this know. is an eleven. One, two, four. Babe, stop doing that face. You do the same face every time. No. Yeah, do that. I wanna get another bite. Wait, let me get another no, one. No, dude, you had like four. Guys, look at let me squeeze it. And for I think it was Hold only on, wait, like babe, let me try to squeeze it. Here, focus. Oh. It's focus on you. Okay, look, y'all, watch when I squeeze. Oh my <sighs> Dude. Everything is going Wait, to be gone. Wait, we didn't even get gone. that sauce. I know that's going to be so good. Alright. Yes. I want some too. You take a bite. And then we're going to move on to the next thing, y'all. I'm sorry. But this, this little thing, yo. Mm. 
This is crazy. Alright, that's enough. Alright, go ahead. Oh, that's a little thick sauce. Mmm, thank you, baby. Mmm, that's good. Oh my god. We're gonna have to come back to this. We're definitely coming back to that, y'all. Guys, that was, that. that was excellent, man. So, right. we're gonna move on to this next thing. This mm -hmm. looks very interesting. This one's like we have to cut it. Yeah. Guys, right. look at the layer on that. <laughs> what is this? The cheese ball. And guys, I'm gonna be real before we bite this. I don't like corn, but man, you haven't tried it. Let's, let's try go. it. Let's go. Y'all, they have one with chicken in here. I know that would have been slack, but we didn't want to get two chickens. Well, everything chicken. All right. The only thing that's blowing it for me is the corn. There's a lot of corn in there. You can't even, if you don't pay attention to it, you, you, you're paying attention to it. Tonight. I'm paying attention to it because there's a lot of corn in there. Everything else, guys, the flavor's on point. The cheese is on point. It literally tastes like you're tasting syrup and pancakes. No, it doesn't. To me, and cheese, but that corn is just throwing me off. Yeah, I see the corn pieces right there. So, I love corn, so I don't have a problem with this at all. So, like, the sweetness, there's, like, a sweetness from it, and that's from the corn. Um, it's, like, sweet and cheesy sweet and cheesy and mm. corny it's very, yeah. very chewy <laughs> corny. and cheesy no. but i'm not I don't, i'm not really feeling that if, if, if i it, give this one a nine i give don't, it, don't even give it no, nothing lower than the eight i give happen it's good i give it you a seven like the corn. i give it a seven i just don't like the corn if but was, why would you give it that low it's good because i don't like the corn that's how bad the corn's doing me right now that's how bad it is. If excluding the corn, this would be a ten. If they put chicken in here, oh my god! For those who do like corn, I would definitely say to get this. It's sweet, it's cheesy, and it just has a good flavor. It's not like too much seasons going on. It's just straight to the point. So I'm gonna pick these out. These look interesting too. Right. Should we? I'm gonna use a fork. Should I use a fork? Just no. I'm gonna use it. All right. Wait for. We're definitely in for a surprise for this one. You ready? Uh huh. Oh! I heard that. Oh my. <gasps> oh. Cheese and guava in that thing. You can see it. Look at that. Mmm. Uh. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. Mm. Okay. It's not even like cream cheese. I feel like it's mozzarella. Yeah, what cheese. kind of cheese is this? Is mozzarella? Okay, there's a the guava kicking in. Mmm. Mm. Guava's very sweet. I always doing what what does it taste like? Not the Pop Tart. Oh a toaster strudel. Kinda. That's what it tastes like, a toaster strudel. The cheese is just a little thick. It is. The cheese is a little thick. It is. The dough is, is perfect. It's like home it's all definitely, definitely homemade. homemade. The guava paste flows with everything in this thing. And the cheese, I think it's meant to be. Yeah, it's like I feel fluffy. like I feel like it's a good balance between the both. I give these it um I give these a nine. I mean I'll give them a nine. I give. I definitely give this. I'll give them a nine. I feel like I would like it a little better if the cheese was a little bit softer. Mm -hmm. Like it, it's not hard. It's just a little chewy. This is the empanada. Let's oh. see. We're gonna split this. They have the same chicken. That's that's definitely some homemade breading. That's crazy. But let me get some more of that chicken. Bro, so you about to take my piece of the chicken? That's right, crazy. Y'all see this? Here, go ahead. You really just stuffed you yours in all, there. All that chicken came out of mine. That's my crazy. Piece. Yeah, I be seeing how she be doing me with these food reviews. <laughs> Dude, there's nothing in here but just chicken. There's not even no cheese in here. Yeah, so there's literally just like the chicken that was in the other thing, um, just in here. Let's just see how this uh, breading is set taste. Guys, what whatever they're seasoning their chicken with, and look, it got major tomatoes I love them. in there. Mm -hmm. It does, yeah. but you can't even taste the tomatoes. You can't even taste that. And look, got onions in here too. It seems like it's been like slow cooked for a long time. The shell is crispy. It's like a. It's crispy and soft. I don't know what to explain. How to explain this? It's like baked. Well, no, it's like it's not baked because it's like oil. It's do you taste? Do you taste that crispy though? I the outside is crispy, but the soft side, the soft part, is 
the outside is crispy and the inside of the, the um you about to say breading. fajita no you was about to say fajita no it wasn't the inside of the uh <laughs> the empanada the breading what of the breading is like softer it is it has a little bit of crunch to it the chicken it's the same chicken that we just had in that uh first thing that we had this sauce is smack this guy is like oh my gosh i could this a 10. this is a 10. that chicken is mm, good I'll try it with this sauce man oh you are no try it with this one i'm almost done let's hurry up and get to dang <sighs> i'm get sorry, to those bro. rice and beans i want to taste that rice all right Guys, oh my gosh, I'm telling so you, y'all, this is so good. Definitely, if y'all have any Venezuelan places around y'all area, go check them go out. Them out. Yeah, I think we do have a couple Venezuelan followers. Remember, someone said to first to do their food, the Venezuela. A couple people told us to, to, that they're gonna be waiting for it. I've said it like five times. And they're gonna be waiting for us to do this video. So now we finally got this video out for y'all. So, guys. Show us some Shout love. out to you guys. And make sure y'all give us a thumbs up on this video. Yes. And don't forget to comment below any other type of videos that y'all would like us to try to do for like food reviews and stuff like that because we literally try to do everything. We're trying to do a lot of like literally a lot of different stuff. Some people are telling us not to do like southern Indian food or something Indian street food. And we could definitely look for that. So let us know. Alright, let's dig into these beans. Get this right here. This is our second to the last thing. Well, no, we still have the drinks. I can't wait to sip on those because mm. my mouth is dry. The, mm. the breading will dry your mouth out, guys, so make sure you do have it's a drink. It's not that bad, though. It's not bad. No, it's so juicy. What is this? What is that? The mayo. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Let me see. It's okay. <gasps> what is in here? I don't know. I cheese? Think it's cheese? They like a lot of cheese. They do. That yeah, no, definitely. That's something about Venezuelan food. A lot of cheese everywhere. It's okay. I give them a six. The sauce is cool and the beans, they're alright. Mm. I like it, man. Um I'd probably say. They weigh it. Now I'll probably say like a, I say a seven. A seven. I give it a six. They're not nasty. It's just I feel like I need some more juice from it. Like there's and not enough I flavor. Feel like, there. I feel like the beans. I mean, not not that all of the beans are gonna be like this, but it was a little bit hard. Like it wasn't cooked all the way because I like mine super super soft, like on the stove for a while. Same. But and I like a lot more juice to it. But other than that, it's cool. And I just feel like the flavor might be a little too salty. A little bit. It's just not not much flavor. Yeah, not much flavor. Let's get on to this rice though. Let's move on to this rice. So Carly dropped half of it. So let's try this other half. <laughs> I didn't drop half of it. You have your own for it. Where is it? Oh, right I there. got it. How are you going to say where is it? I well, was pulling it, it, it up. It was hiding. All right, go Whoa. ahead. Whoa. Whoa. Mmm. Mmm. So, I would definitely mix that with one of those sandwiches or that without the corn. But, guys, like me, I like eating rice plain regardless. Yeah. We, just, we literally eat rice like almost every day. And that's pretty damn good. It's oh, different no. though. It's definitely different. I feel like they use a different type of rice. I feel like it's the type of rice that they use and the type of oil that they use. And they might put a little bit of salt or maybe like a little bit of like a white, like a... Like a light adobo type of seasoning, but like a, a like not the, like the yellow one because it will give it more color. Mm -hmm. I don't know, it's something, but it's good. It I is. give the rice like a nine. I give the rice a nine too. That was good. My mouth is super dry, babe. Let's move on to these drinks, man. All right, so let's taste. Let's taste this tea first. Right, Shit, while we're at it, I'm gonna get some more of this. <laughs> it's not even sweet. It's like a blackberry. You have so much chicken in between your teeth. <laughs> oh, I do feel it. That's some good stuff. Never mind. Appreciate you, guy. Whoever handed us that, the, our food. No, this is good. It tastes tea. like a. 
It's like a. Are you sure? Yeah, it did say tea on there. It's black. It's like blackberry tea, and it's not even sweet though. No, it's, it's not. It's like watery. It tastes. It's not watery. It just tastes like natural, like pure. Yes. It don't taste like anything extra added to. Like this. you know, American sweet tea. Like they put a pound, a of, pound sugar of sugar in there. Sugar in there. Like this is actually like tasteful like yeah, it's not just good. sugar that's really good, yeah, I, that that good. A 10. I would buy a gallon of that let me try this one yeah first. you try this one first uh, you know it's gonna be good dude so that's the passion fruit y'all be careful it's dripping where right there yeah. take the sip take the sip no off the cup. i'm not sipping off of that you, sip you off always sip off of the I'll top of the cup that's nasty oh my gosh go ahead baby taste that dude taste that <laughs> That shit good. Yeah, I don't know what it I don't know what it is, but that passion fruit is good. We just got a passion fruit drink too right in the fridge. I give that one a 10 too. Those are both those are both like hand in hand. I don't feel like one's better than the other. I feel like they're both. Come really on, good. man. What's better? What's better? I like both of them. This passion fruit just kills the game, you guys. It's so fresh. I like both natural. of them. Both like, of them are really good. You're capping. They're, no, they're both really good. But if I was to choose one, this passion fruit, really? this is the one. Yes. This is some good stuff, y'all. Guys, everything about this food, it just I just had my opinion on the pancake. Well, that's Venezuela because you don't pancakes. That's because I don't eat corn. I'm just but if you at, did, you would like it. Everything was excellent. I'm so happy. That we chose, we found we chose this little hole food. in the wall. Like we literally went through this whole plaza to go inside and figure out that it was a mall, and like it was just wild. But we found it. <laughs> we got our food. Everything was great. It was wild. Again, shout out to a Repa Grill. If you guys are in Atlanta, come to a Repa Grill. It's come in get some it's Venezuela. in Plaza Fiesta. Yes, come get some and, Venezuelan uh, food. Uh, 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 Beautiful Highway. Let's go that. Come get some Venezuelan food. It's so good, guys. If you guys want to get exactly what we got, tell us what you think. Man, this is some good ass food, man. Nah, We're about to finish everything behind the camera. We'll see you guys in the next video. I appreciate you guys again for watching our videos. We love you guys. Peace out.